What's up everyone, this is Cybernet8610, and today we're going to have some more random pack openings. Yes, a new season of random pack openings, so we have a bunch of new packs. Let's see, I believe uh, 32 random packs here, a few doubles here and there, of course, uh, that just happens. You know, I randomly, I order random packs, and then, you know, I don't even know what I'm going to get. That's what, and honestly makes it more fun that way too. Uh, so yeah, I think we have some pretty awesome packs, pretty good variety, and so per video we're going to be opening up uh, 8 packs per video, so that will give us... Uh, Four videos, if my math is correct. So yeah, uh, randomly, I'm just going to choose eight packs, and then we're going to get to opening them. All right, so let's see. Uh, one, two, three, four, why not, five and six, <laughs> seven, and why not, just go with those, eight. All right, so one, two, just double check. Okay, that's eight packs. We have a... Looks like we got three of a uh, fun on shockwave out of those sets, but oh well. Uh, so yeah, here we go for our. Here we go with our first packs we have today. See a pretty good variety, and let's get to it. So Ragnarok, why not? It's on front. <laughs> it's on the top of the stack of cards. Why not go with it first? All right. Let's see, hopefully get some awesome from this. Get Maxi or something. That'd be. Awesome. Oh, right at the beginning. Oh, man. The go the golden apples. <laughs> well, it's just like last time. Random pack opening. Evidently, it's going to be awesome this time yet again. And Doppel Warrior. Good rare. <laughs> I'm at a loss for words, really. I, I never expect actually getting a secret at the beginning of random pack openings because you don't know what you're going to get. So, oh, man. <laughs> that's, that's freaking awesome. I hadn't seen this card in actually a while, either. <laughs> Whoa, that's, that's a good start. I mean... I'll just put the hollows I get to the side. Uh, Duelist Pack, Aster Phoenix. Let's see what we get from that. I know some people don't really like the Duelist Packs, but like I said, it's random, so I don't even know what I'm going to get. And sometimes they can be pretty awesome. Uh, I'm Tiro Phoenix Enforcer. See, so again, I'm a Tohiro, so that's awesome in my book. So yeah, I like Phoenix Enforcer. He's pretty cool. I think he was only in one episode, though, unfortunately. If I remember right. I need to rewatch GX, actually. Contact with Gusto with Hidden Arsenal 5 here, so everything's going to be hollows, of course. So, yeah, not too bad. Hidden Arsenal 5 was an alright set. Alright, I guess I'll put those aside since they're hollows. Alright, another one of the Aster Phoenix Duelist Packs. So let's see what we get from this. We will get uh, Diamond Dude, that's a good common, and Destiny uh, Hero Dreadmaster. I like Destiny Heroes, they're pretty awesome. Uh, some of the other ones, too, like uh, Dreadmaster. I, th I always thought he was really awesome looking. Uh, let's see. Order of Chaos. Why not? Let's see what we get from this. Alright. We have uh, Evo Instant. Cool card. Uh, Insector Centipede. Good common card. Alright, let's see. Oh, we actually have three uh, put on Shockwaves. In a row. Might as well get them all done in a row. Alright. We have... Whoa, it's already upside down. Uh, I know we already have hollow, but let's read off the rare first. Uh, Murmur of the Forest and Alexandrite Dragon. One day a piece, too. Good common. Yeah, Alexandrite Dragon. Really awesome card. I really like the artwork. I know I say that all the time, but seriously, I like the art. Some people should really notice some of the Yu-Gi-Oh! artwork. I mean, it, there's some really awesome looking cards out there. And plus, being a normal card with 2,000 attack, that's pretty awesome, especially back in the day, uh, whenever we didn't see cards that powerful, you know. You always had to tribute for anything that had 2,000 attack or more. So it's really awesome for me to see uh, a strong card like that. And also, it's a hollow. <laughs> Let's put it over to the side. I'm already, you know... Try to be organized, and I'm already messing it up. Alright, let's see. Poisonous Winds and uh, Wind Up Night. And <laughs> Gym Turtle. <laughs> Whoa, the hollows just don't stop. Uh, Gym Turtle, it got reprinted as a uh, dual terminal actually pretty recently too, so that's awesome. Uh, I like this card. I like it in Gym Nights, alright. I don't know if my. I think the latest one, the deck that I'm using right now, doesn't use it unfortunately, but it's still an awesome uh, card for them. So yeah, not a bad hollow to get. Right, our last card, Fun on Shockwave. We're going to get another holo. We're going to get all hollows from our Fun on Shockwave. Let's see. All right, and we have a Junk Defender, and, oh man, number 20 Giga Brilliant. Even though it's gotten a reprint recently, this card is still so freaking awesome. I really like this card. It's one of my favorite number cards out there. And uh, One Day of Peace also is a common. So, and also all of our, we had three hollows from our phone on Shockwave. So evidently it was awesome to get double, or a couple of uh, reprint packs or whatever from that, you know. So yeah, uh, not bad at all.
So yeah, we have uh, number 20, Dim Turtle, Alexandrite Dragon, our Hidden Arsenal 5 cards, I don't really want to name over all of them, and uh, the Golden Apples, which is freaking epic. That is a secret rare. Unfortunately, not first ed, but still awesome. So yeah, tell me what you guys think about these packs. Hopefully you have enjoyed these. Thanks for watching, and remember, we still have, I believe, three videos to go with more random pack openings. Alright, later guys.